Okay, we got Alex Ward from Portland, Oregon here. All right, Alex. See that forehand, lefty. Pretty good pattern of swing here. Yep, pulls across his chest nicely. Doesn't always have his feet set up ahead of the swing, which I'd like to see him work on a little more. His athletic foundation isn't quite as strong. Okay, Alex, I love the stroke. I just don't like what you got to build on. Okay, here's what we got to fix. Get in your foundation position like this for me, just like I am. Okay, go down in your knees. Press your butt back. Good posture here. Right. Now press those butt, that, that rear end back. Don't let me push. Me. Don't let me push. Me. You see how that you tighten in here? Do it again. Okay, so we just imported a little bit of foundation. Come on, let me see it. Show me that position. Right, now hold tight and give me that same forehand. Come on, hold, press your rear end back, get it tight in here. It's gonna help you pull this forehand. That's it, good posture. Now keep the hips back. You go to pull and they go like this. You gotta keep them pressed back. Get your weight into that left foot. He wants to spend a lot of time, well, how old are you? You got to spend some time on your footwork, man. You're a little bit dragging there. A lot of that has to do with foundation. They tend to look a little more heavy on their feet and sluggish when they don't put foundation qualities to it. You should look into the AP belt we use here a lot. Helps them develop that. Get that left foot out to the ball. Let's get it out there a little bit better, okay? Here we go. Left foot out to that ball. Think of what I'm saying. Push your left foot out to the ball. That's not doing it. Show me what I mean. Left foot out to the ball. The ball's out there. Your foot's not ever coming out to it. You're going right foot. If the ball's traveling down there, where do I want the left foot? Get it out closer to the ball. Okay? You understand? Get the left foot out to it. That's it. Left foot out to the ball. Now, you don't necessarily have to step forward when you do it, but that's a lot better. You got into the box now. You will want to see him step forward ahead of contact here with this foot. Just back in here is fine, loading into that left side. Here we go. Think of what I just said. You don't need to step forward with it, just step out for the ball. Good. A couple more. Got to work on that footwork. Where's that foundation I had put in? All right, let's take a look at the backhand side, lefty. Okay, here we go. All right, here it is. Strong grip sets here. I like the swing line here too. <clears throat> Really spent some time on his athletic development. He's getting trying to make a good turn into this side, which is great. Yeah. Again, working on the lower body over the next year will make a big difference for him. He's going to break down getting forced too easily because he doesn't always apply his athletic skills that he has in him. Be your stroke's beautiful there, bud. I'm telling you, all your work is from here down. you got to start putting the legs, the legs into what you're doing. You know, down in here, like when you're playing soccer or basketball with somebody, you can't jump in, right? So this is a real movement intensive sport. You gotta really start getting into the movement stuff a little bit more, don't you think? All right, let's take a look at that. I love his backhand. There's nothing wrong with it other than that athleticism isn't quite there. Let's, let's see the serve real quick. All right. Yeah, that backhand's as clean as a whistle. Serve technique looks pretty good too. Very good technique. It's got a very nice motion. What I would say is, sometimes the kids are really good visually and copying better players that they're watching play. Technique-wise, he's got some great things that are set up in this serve. 
What I don't think is happening is he's not getting the result or the function out of this swing as much as he could. So I'm going to show him a drill real quick called the fence drill. Come on back here. interim step where he's hitting at the fence so he's not worried about hitting it out and he's just exploring how to pop the ball better. Now he's striking it a little bit cleaner with a little more head speed, a little more power on the serve. So try to bring it down, do exactly what you were doing hitting it at the fence. So he's got a nice, nice, nice motion and development here. Love what he's doing. Whoever's working with him is doing a great job. Excellent. Try not to be too fancy with the footwork. Try to keep that right foot down if you can. You could do little room tennis. You could, you could be quick with the wheelchair. One more. Give it a good pop, man. You're holding back. You could have a big serve, but I don't know if you realize it. Got to go after it, though. Can't be afraid to hit it. You got a good serve technique, man. It's beautiful. I mean, it's taking shape like a rope, but you got to be confident with it. Swing. Right? It's going to feel like you're smashing a racket on that. Strokes are great. Your footwork is what's going to cause you to lose matches if you don't catch up to, to your strokes, right? Got it? You having fun here? Yeah. All right, Scott, good to have you, man. See you later.